be recording. Good morning, Michigan. Looking at you, back at you with another G Brothers review. I am Nico Little Bro, and if you didn't know that, Stefanos, big bro, and we are back at you with another pizza review. We are in where are we at? Harrison Township. We're at Harrison Township. What is this place called, oh, Seth? Just south. Oh, Brioni's. Just south of what were you gonna say? Just south of Jefferson and 16. Just south. Look at the camera. Just, just south, south of Jefferson and Metro Parkway. Metro Parkway. It's called Brioni's. Now we read reviews. I already said that. It, okay. We read reviews for this place, right? And they were like, bro, sure did. Seven point seven. So it's amazing. It's a hidden gem. They were saying hidden gem. They, they were love saying, it. One person said, "What I drive an hour, an hour away, away with my wife just to get this once a once a month." So. The reviews on this place is like hyped up, right? Mm -hmm. I went up there, right? I go to go in, and there's couches everywhere inside there. It's just couches set up, right? I'm like, oh, this is amazing, right? So I went to go sit in the couch. The lady goes, hey, we're only doing curbside pickup. I'm like, oh, my bad. They got the little old tables out there so you can sit down on the outside. It's just used one to, table. It's one table. Whatever. Anyways, um, so I go, oh, my bad. She goes, so I go, do you want me to just go outside? As I'm trying to sit on the couch, she's like, yeah. Well, it says curbside pickup on the... I know. I didn't even notice it. So then I do that. She comes outside. Our pizza's ready. She comes outside. And she goes, here you go. And it has something that says the big slice. Please order a big slice. I don't see anything. It's on the other side of the door. Um, they didn't advertise the big slice to us. Uh, I asked the lady. I go, what's a big slice? And she goes, oh, we did it before COVID. We don't do it anymore. I go, well, what was it? She goes, no, we took like a square pizza and cut it in half. But the way they did it, it was crossed on all sides. And it was like a big slice like this that she said. And I was like, so what would COVID affect you doing that? From what she said. <laughs> she just kind of looked at me. <laughs> she went back inside the store. I was like, well, you stupid. You can still sell the pizza, but you can't sell the big slice. You're still cook. I don't know. Anyways, she was a lady. Yes. So anyway, so um, uh, what do I want to say? So yes, we're yep. at Brioni's on in Cl what do you say, Clinton Township? Harrison Township. Harrison Township. Harrison Township. Uh, hidden gem, supposedly. Let's take a look at the pizza real quick. A nice box. I like the box. I don't know why I'm always into the boxes, bro. It's like the present thing. But every time we open up a present so far today, it hasn't been a good present. It hasn't been a good present. I'm going to put it on my shoulder, bro. Look at this, bro. This is this is game. This is game. Look at that game, bro. That's game right there. You don't even know about that. Mm. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, it's got the little uh, pepperonis that turn upside the turnovers. That's the old school ones. Mm. Uh, why doesn't this pie look... It doesn't look like it's really tasty. Hmm. Looks can be deceiving, I guess. This doesn't yeah, look... Yeah, I don't buy into that. This doesn't take your slice, big bro. Get your paper towel out and take your slice. I don't, I don't know about Tell this, me what guys. to do. Um, you know what this looks like to me? What? And I don't want to judge it too badly right now, but it looks like a pizza you'd get from 7-Eleven. Looks like a 7-Eleven pizza. Oh, no. Is it really, uh... Slopatastic? Okay. Do you want to go for another slice? No, you could have just helped me, though. All right. I, I would let that rest for a minute, bro. Stupid. I'd let that rest for a minute. Yeah, I would mind your own business for a minute. I'm going to crack open my slice real quick. It's actually not even that hot. Oh, really? it's got steam going on. Okay. So, real quick, guys. Let me show you the pizza. All right, half the ingredients fall off. Here's the pizza. Arter carriage floppy. It's burning hot though too. But it's a floppy toppy. Look at that. All right, let me try to get some of the ingredients back on there. I hate it when it's a pizza this sloppy. I hate it, dude. I this you guys so far. Well, Cause by the time we would have got it home, it wouldn't have been like this. So don't be so judgmental, stupid. I don't even. I don't even know what to do with this one. I have to eat the, uh, the topping separately. Do it taste any good? This reminds me of. Uh, you know what this is? Mm. If you don't get the slices of Sorrentos and you get the whole pie, it tastes like Sorrentos. Wait, the old one or the new one? No, the new one. Yeah, because I was about to say, this is old one. But not the Sorrentos that we do in slices. I'm talking about, like, the other one. Let me go in for the first chew. Get in the camera. I just ate spaghetti. I slurped up my whole pizza. Who left a review and said this was a hidden gem? Go read the comments. For a large pie, it costs us $12 and what? 
Some cents. Twelve dollars and what? Some cents. Brioni's. Okay. Um, I like the sauce. Sauce is. Dang. Oh, sauce is tangy. The sauce is actually good. They tried on the sauce. The cheese I don't like. You know why? Mm. This is that kind of cheap cheese that they just throw on there. And they put a bunch of it on there. And then it doesn't melt right on the slice. It just doesn't. Even if this was cold and you got it, the, the, the cheese would still pull off when you pulled it away. It just doesn't melt on the slice correctly. I kind of like this, though. The pepperonis are nothing to be surprised about. I'm getting an extra, like, really, really high hint of salt. Uh, the crust was actually pretty good. It's buttered. Buttered. Buttered crust. What do you think about the crust? Wow, we're having a bad day today. We're having a bad day today. So... I'm already kind of jaded with scores. We're not having a good day. This is not that bad of a pizza, but this is not a hype. This is way too overhyped. This is way too overhyped. I'm yeah, gonna take I wonder, more. I wonder if these people have ever eaten pizza. That are leaving the comments. Can I get my score now? Every time I'm taking a bite, I'm slurping like I'm slurping pasta, bro. This is not. not a bad pizza, though. I'm done. Um, big bro will go first this time. I like the sauce. I don't like the cheese. I like the pepperoni. I disagree on this pizza a lot. I'm going to put it back here. We're going to really disagree on this pizza. I'm going to give it a 6-2. Oh, wow. So you feel the same way I did about it then. You feel pretty much the same way. It's nothing It's nothing major. Like, if I'm driving down the street, I don't know what's around here. Anyways, if you're driving around here, I mean, I might maybe look for a better... Pizza? Um, I don't know. So you were 6'2", right? I'm in that ballpark. Oh, sauce. So sauce was okay. It was tangy. Cheese? No, I don't like that cheese. The pepperonis were the cup, old school cup pepperonis, but didn't have oh. any flavor to them, dude. Like, I don't know how the, your pepperoni doesn't have any flavor. She told us they were spicy. Yeah, we, yeah, she said they're spicy pepperoni. That's not spicy. They might have made a mistake. I don't even, I don't think that's what, that was our pizza. Because they told us 20, 25 minutes. We got here in like seven minutes and it was ready. So I don't know if that was even our pizza. We waited on him to smoke the square. We, it still wasn't no 25 minutes, though. They just say that. Okay. Uh, you know what? Because of the service, too, like, the couch stuff I kind of like, but whatever. Advertising stuff that you can't sell on the window, I don't like that. Please visit them, visit them still, though. Visit them. I had a seizure again. Visit them still here in uh, Harrison Township. Harrison Township. Um, just south of... Um it's on just south of Metro Parkway on Jefferson. Just south of Metro Parkway on Jefferson. A big bro score was 6-2. I'm going to give this a 6-1. So we were in the same thing. Yeah, I was so shocked that, when I... Because when you... Because I was shocked we were at the same... I think you were going to go... I thought you were going to go higher. So I was shocked when you said 6-2. I was like, oh, you think shit. I was go higher? Because I thought you kind of liked it better. I didn't like that pizza that much. That's an average pizza. If it's in my neighborhood, I might get it once every two, three months. It's not something I'm going to get all the time. Actually, I might not even get it. Anyways, you guys, remember to comment, like, smash the like button, comment don't, down below. Don't. Um, follow us on Facebook and on Twitter. We're going to do an Instagram page. Follow us on Instagram. We'll just have pictures of everything. I couldn't even take pictures in there that I wanted to with the couches and everything. I just want to take a picture of how they had a, it would look like a chill spot. That might have affected your score. Um, no, it didn't. I'm just joking. Anyways, but remember, people ask me all the time, Steph, what are the three most important things in life? You know what I tell them? Why is everybody asking this three most important things in life? People ask me all the time. I look like an asking type of guy. You know that, right? Yeah, I don't. I do. That's why people don't ask you questions and they ask me questions. I tell them the three most important things in life are always the same. This is your way to success. It's your faith. Your family. And food. Not this food. Stay safe. Till next time, boys. Stay real. Real's a new word of the day. Stay real. Stay real. Stop being faking.